You're chewing, you're snacking on cactus. This, this is, is raw cactus, by the raw, way. Raw, raw, but there's all sorts of ways to eat it, mm -hmm. and we will do that when we come back, okay? Mm -hmm. So we've made our way to North Phoenix, and we are here at Barrio Queen, where we were told we have to come here to experience the food and also try some cactus. Chef Mixologist, welcome. Hi, how are you guys? They want us to eat cactus. Yeah, you're I've never eaten a, a cactus. This I haven't either. Well, yes, so you do you see? just bite it right here? No, 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 we there's a little process. No, 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 I mean, you can if you want. I'm not gonna stop you, <laughs> but, you know, you're not gonna like that feeling. But, okay. So, okay. No, there's a little process, you know, we have. So cactus, right? There's a lot of different types of, of cactus. This one being the uh, oval one, this is the uh, most the edible one. You can eat any kind of cactus, but this one's more. How do you more, get more, the more uh, uh, spine off? So this is what you do. It comes it comes uh, just, just like that with the thorns right there. So you cut the sides. Yeah. It's already cut like that. And then you just grab it and you just go. And whack. And that's it. And, and then you turn it, off. same thing. Yeah, you, you take that and you're left with this. Okay. And now uh, we're gonna dice it. Can you eat it raw? You can eat it raw. Oh, absolutely. Does anybody this is do a, that? Uh, I do it. I do it. You can do it in a smoothie. You can saute it. You can kidding? grill it. Yeah, you can try it. Yeah, okay. of course. Absolutely. It's full of liquid. It's right. A it's, it's a lot. Of, yes, it is. It is. Okay. So, no, it's it's That's it's not really bad. good. No, it's, right. it's not bad at all. You said it kind of tastes so, like green beans a little bit. Uh, the they, texture. The, the texture of a green yeah. bean. Okay. Uh, there's a little acidity. So, yeah. Oh, there's a lot. Oh my gosh! Yeah. So I would eat it raw. Yeah, I, I would eat it. Yeah, I'm doing it again. So it's very fresh tasting. At Barrio Queen, we saute it with a little bit of garlic and olive oil. But if I asked to get a, like a cheesesteak, could, could you do it? Absolutely. So we have we have something like that over here. We have a uh, carnitas grilled cheese. That's kind of our version. It's got the bread, you know, melted Oaxaca cheese and carnitas. Carnitas, it's a uh, slow braised pork. What's a good way to wash it down? <laughs> well, you know, we got, we got our mixologist here for that. I think the best way to wash it down is with a great margarita from Barrio Queen. Okay. I hear you guys have a few, just a few. a few. About yeah. 20 or so. Uh, we also have about 150 plus tequilas, over 300 different varieties of agave spirits from mezcals to bacanoras. We have our El Rey margarita, which is featuring one of the best tequilas in the world. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I heard this was the star of the whole place. It is, definitely. Why? Yeah, so it's, it's our Cadillac beyond Cadillacs. So that margarita there goes for about $27. It's a steal. <laughs> Big one too. <laughs> oh, I spilled it. Oh my gosh! Wash it down. That's fantastic. You can't even tell there's tequila in it. It's right. so smooth. Yeah, super smooth. Hey, yep. real quickly, what is this bottle here? I've seen it before. What is that? So that is our Dia de los Muertos bottle. Uh, absolutely unbelievable bottle. Very rare. Only a few restaurants in the world are going to have How that bottle. How much an ounce? How much you're going to spend? Two hundred dollars an ounce on that. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> yes. Wow. It's a steal. Sammy, it's a bargain, is it in the I budget promise. for this trip? <laughs> yeah. We get one what bottle. We don't need a budget. We got your credit card. <laughs> Thanks for letting absolutely. us stop by and hang out with you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate some it. of this cactus to go. Yeah, I'm really liking it. In other words, you got to try this. Yeah. All of it. So folks are already tweeting me. It was so great. We had a great time. They had live music. It was a patio. It was packed with people. It was wonderful. I'm getting some tweets already. What does raw cactus taste like? And I didn't say this in the when we did that, but I, I said afterward, it's kind of fruity. Like, it's so yeah. juicy because there's so much juice in it. It is a succulent uh -huh. plant. So I see why people do it to get their water and stuff when you're lost in the desert, that kind sure. of thing. I like it. I could do it. And they grill it, all kinds of stuff. So I like it, too. It's maybe in the family of a jicama. Maybe it's that succulent and mm -hmm. juicy. Mm -hmm. When you bite into it. So I'm, I start to leave the place, and I just goes, hey, 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 come back over here. They have another drink. Wait till you see this. Okay. And so I'm going to try this you, liquid death. I brought in moral support. Your name is? Marta. From New York? Yes. And you are? Kirsten. Kirsten from? Texas. From Texas. And Matt, of course, is a mixologist here. Yes. What's in liquid death? So this is our three chili-infused tequila habaneros, chili de arbol, jalapeno, lime, ancho reyes, chipotle liqueur, and some agave. Should I chug it? I wouldn't. But here we go. Give it a shot. It's not that bad at all. Oh! Oh, for the love of God! <laughs> 
He's not the first one to run away after a sip. Cheers. Who has milk and or bread? It actually is pretty darn tasty. It is. The pain went away quickly. You have to keep drinking it, that's the trick. You have to keep drinking it. I'm losing it her. Give it a shot. Well, liquid death did not kill me. It, it kind of was good. And you're still sipping on it this morning. Cheers. Cheers. So already a fun time so far in Arizona. It was a packed day, I tell you. By the way, if you come Thank out you, here, Barrio Queen. Uh, there's a gigantic shopping complex that that restaurant is in. Uh, it's called Desert Ridge. It's like north of Phoenix. Yeah, um, and kind of northeast. And they have a nice little, look at these mugs. Aren't they beautiful, hand-painted? Yeah. Food was fantastic, by the way. Fish tacos I had later. Delish.